Hey there, today we are going to talk about a topic that may feel heavy, but it is crucial to understand. Yes, I am talking about depression, a word we hear often, but I want to clarify that while I am not an expert, I am just someone who wants to spread awareness about this topic. So grab a seat and let's dive in together. So what is depression? Well, in simple terms, it's a serious mental disorder that can affect people of all ages and genders. It is also known as clinical depression. But what are its symptoms? Depression isn't just feeling sad from time to time. It's like a dark cloud that hangs over someone, making it hard to find joy in things they used to love. It can show up in many ways, such as feeling of hopelessness, loss of interest in activities and daily tasks, changes in appetite or sleep patterns, thoughts of self-harm or suicide, and even in the form of physical pain, cramps or headache, which don't have any clear physical cause and won't go away with treatment. So what actually causes depression? Well, it's not just one thing. It's a combination of various factors, including life event, trauma, certain medical condition, or even genetics. Think of it like a puzzle with many pieces that come together to create the picture. The good news is, depression is treatable and no one has to face it alone. If you experience signs or symptoms of depression and they persist or don't go away for a couple of weeks, then contact your nearest healthcare provider. Remember that earlier the treatment begins, the more effective it is. It's okay to ask for help when you need it, seeking help from a friend, family member, or taking care of yourself by getting enough sleep, exercising can help to ease the burden of depression. And let's not forget about the power of support. Simply being there for someone who is struggling with a depression, offering a listening ear or shoulder to lean on and encouraging them to seek help from a mental health professional can make a world of difference.